Fellas, what's good? What's good? As you can see, I'm in my jersey, man, after practice. And um, right now, I'm talking to you guys, you know, right through, right through the laptop. You know what I mean? We be working. I want y'all to stay tuned. You got to check out the video on how we, uh, me and my man, Killer Calion, on how we did on how we did Georgetown, girl, the song that's up on Hip Hop Game. I did my verse right here in the whip, and Killer, Killer recorded a little bit of things right here in the whip. He recorded in his studio, you know what I mean? We doing it back at the studio in the excursion. It's crazy right now. I do my drops from here when I go home. I be busy, so I can't be home, you know, uh, doing things. I got to attend to my kids and everything, so anytime I get a chance, you know, uh, I lay down, do some drops for the DJs, you know. I'm having fun with this, man. I'm having fun with this music. It's, it's a hobby to me, you know what I mean? But uh, I've def definitely been, been inspired, you know, by Mob Deep Nice and then the and then the other guys like MC Shan and um, Carl Mega, you know, Lake the Kid, Nature, um, Black Poet back on the scene right now looking fresh to death, you know what I mean? So. Shout out to all the Queens, Miss Rappers, all this, you know, I am three and from this mob, Nitty, Gambino, was cracking, Scarface was good. RP, all oh, good, man. G.O.D. Part 3, Chinky, ACD, Crime Fam, of course, my artists, Worldwide Warriors, you know what I mean? Ruck, Chalice, you know what I mean? Foul Measy, Foul Monday, what's good? Hey, yo, we got the. The studio in the excursion, we ain't even finished. We got the mixing board. The mixing board is going to be put in the next day, maybe today or tomorrow. Got the, the production in the back. We're going to have all this. This whole joint going to be a, going to be a studio. Look, you see that? Now? That's my jacket right now. You see the mic? I'll show you all the inbox real fast. The inbox. This is my cigar. I don't smoke weed. It's a cigar. So, so you see the inbox right there, you know what I mean? So anytime I'm driving, I get an idea or something, you know what I mean? I'm driving my way home, I can just pull over and record, and I ain't got to waste no time. This mic right here, nice mic. You know, I'm about to move this mic in the crib and move the other mic here. I got the blue mic in the house, but this mic actually, you know, it actually sounds better, you know what I mean? So. We're going to be working with that, you know, uh, this mount. It only costs about, you see where it's mounted at. A man mounted it right here from H-Town. Made a whole new case for the inbox and the whip. And all the wires is, all the wires is um, inside the car, so you can't really see the wires. You know, the laptop and the plugs, the plugs is all wired in there. So we're going to give you all another exclusive uh, making of the studio in the car. Look out for that. Look out for that. It's called a stew excursion. You know what I mean? It only costs about eight hundred to a thousand dollars to get everything mounted. It wasn't even that expensive. So anybody that got, I know the recession is kind of messed up right now. But if you got the money to do it, you know, and you get a lot of ideas in the car. Just put the joint right in the whip. They ain't even in the way. You know what I mean? You want to bang your head? I'm driving. I don't even know what the mic is there. Actually, so I don't want people to see a mic in my car all the time. I think I'm police. You know what I mean? I always unscrew the mic every now and then, but I just got finished doing the drop for keepitrill.com, you know what I mean? So I had to, you know, get the mic hooked up and do it big. But check it. It's your boy Artest in the H-Town. I'm going to holler back. Hiphopgame.com. What's poppin'? What's poppin'? What's poppin'?